Well, good morning everybody. It's October the 18th and I'm heading up the Cairnsmore of Cars Fairn for a wee day walk. So I've passed this hill many a time. Heading down further into the Galloway Forest Park, probably closer to the Merrick and Glen Trool and Loch Dee. And it sits on its own on the left of the A713. And I've always wondered what it'd be like to have a walk up it, it looks nice. And I was also thinking of a wild camp, um, but not for this weekend. But there's a wee lock in March, so I'm going to check it out and see if it's uh, a good spot. Anyway, easy walking so far and not a soul to be seen. Very, very quiet. First fill up of the day. Not a soul. One thing I do like about the Galloway Hills is you get away from the honey pots and the crowds. It's so quiet. I'm off the bulldozer track now. Up the top of the hill. I was watching. Ewan McGregor on the long way up, I don't know if you've seen it on Apple TV, watch it, it's good. Um, but this is like the polar opposite, he arrived at Machu Picchu and was just mobbed by people looking for his autograph, the place was stowed. This is so much like the polar opposite. So quiet, I haven't seen a soul. Let's see where we are. Okay, so we're just here, so not far to the summit, just above me to the right. There's quite a lot of height gain yet. You can see Aaron away in the distance there. Just over the Clyde. And the views are opening up over the, the hills towards the Merrick and the general Galloway Forest Park hills. There's certainly no navigation issues. Follow the dry stain dike and you should get there. Things are flattening out now. We must be pretty close to the summit. It's just kind of started to level now, so we must be nearly there. So, made it. You're looking down towards the Solway Firth, as far as I can tell. Looking south. There's a wee second cairn as well. And then looking north, unfortunately, there's a bit of a big wind farm over the back here, which I never knew existed. Right, I'm going to tuck into a wee snack. Uh, while I'm doing that, we were away last weekend as well actually at uh, Crawfordland and Dumgoyne and Errol Seat and uh, a couple other places as well. So I'll just show you a wee few clips of those while I'm having a snack and I'll bring you back.
getting a bit chilly, it's time to go. Good we walk, two hours, let's see how long it takes to get down. So I've made it over the black shoulder and we're just heading towards Danul, which is that hill ahead of us there. Lunchtime soon I hope. Stop on the top of the, uh, the next hill, grab a bite to eat and then uh, we should be about an hour from the car. Nice wee uh, circuit though, it's lovely. It worked out well, the weather's been great. Short steep section. So this is a wee subsidiary top called Williana. Very strange name. I don't know what the history of it is. Anyway, I'll show you around. It'll be the last view we get today. And uh, I'm really just on the last descent down towards the uh, main track now. So probably about 30, 40 minutes away. But it's been a good one. So there you go, that was Cairns Moor of Castfairn. Done and dusted in 4 hours 20 minutes, or about half an hour on the summit. So thanks again for watching everybody, sorry there was no wild camping in this one, but I hope you enjoyed the views anyway. And uh, I will see you for the next video when I next get out. Thanks again for watching, cheers.